New functionality within PowerShape Pro 2016 allows us to create primitives from points. You can collect these points by either probing a physical part with a point probe or you can use mouse clicks on a scanned mesh. To do this I'm going to go to the wizards toolbar and you can see we've got this new icon primitives from points. So I'm going to select this and it brings up a new dialog. You can see here we can extract planes, lines, arcs, cylinders, cones and spheres. So I'm going to start by extracting a solid cone from the centre of this part. So I need to take a minimum of seven points. I can start clicking on my model and when I've got seven you can see my cone appears. So I can right click to accept that. Now I'm going to toggle over to create a surface cylinder and here I need to create at least six points. You can see my cylinder is created. Now because we're reverse engineering rather than inspecting we can actually go in here and set the radius to be a specific value. We can also change the IJK orientation of our primitive. Now I'm going to toggle back to solids and create a solid sphere and take a minimum of four points. Again I'm going to go in here and set my radius to be something sensible. Now we've made it easier to toggle between laser scanning a freeform part and probing the geometrical features of the same part. If I open up the laser scanning options you can see that at the end here we now have primitives from points within the laser scanning toolbar. If I open that up I can go ahead and extract a solid cylinder. Set my orientation like so. I'll say OK. And just to prove that we are creating primitives here.